Hey everybody, this video is a showcase, haha, ha, of Infinity Auto V4, an auto hotkey auto clicker for Cookies Inc. So a bit of a history of myself. I've been playing Cookies Inc. to some extent since November of 2016, but I did not seriously join the games community until June 2020. There were many stints of me playing for a couple months at a, of a time and then quitting. And then in 2019, I played through pretty much the whole year, but I was just on a team of my own as well as most of 20, half of 2020. Aside from a four month hiatus, I have been exclusively a member of Storm, the top ranked team in Cookies Inc. as of the time of this video being uploaded. In the summer of 2020, I made a physical auto clicker using iOS switch control and a rotating fan. This setup was pretty inefficient, and while it never malfunctioned, it came at the cost of the usage of my actual phone. This auto clicker, when running, was capable of collecting around 18 million cookies per hour. I could not run it during much of the day, so I usually averaged somewhere from 1.5 to 2.5 billion cookies per season. In November of 2020, I returned to the game after four months of school-related hiatus. This time, I set up a similar switch control setup, but with a Raspberry Pi. The Raspberry Pi acted as a virtual Bluetooth keyboard, sending the grave key on an eight-second loop. The grave key was capable of triggering the switch control recipe, which made the collecting process less cumbersome. And just so you know, the grave is a relatively unused key on the top of the top left of the keyboard. Still, the problem remained that I was using my primary phone and as such could not collect on a 24-7 basis. On January 8th, 2021, I was in a Discord voice call with three other Storm players while a player named Stewie was setting up an auto using Pullover's macro creator on Bluestacks. This inspired me to try to do the same, so I used my old Asus laptop as testing grounds. By the next day, which was a Saturday, so I had a lot of free time to code, I had fin finalized version 1 of Infinity Auto. It was capable of detecting the shadow cookie, clicking the sh cookie sheet and the live event in the top slot. In spite of its simplicity, it collected about 20 million cookies per hour. I continued developing for the remainder of that day. I had discovered that Pullover's macro creator was actually a GUI, or graphical user interface, wrapper of AutoHotKey, a macro scripting language. PMC lacked many advanced logical sequences, including function calls, so I switched to AutoHotKey and converted the version 1 file to AHK format. As the evening progressed, I became determined to implement live event detection, and over the course of two hours, I processed 54 unique images and began working on Infinity Auto version 2. By midnight, I was complete, and overnight tests showed that my new auto was capable of collecting 24 million cookies per hour, higher than what any legitimate auto had sustained for more than an hour or two. Infinity Auto version 3 was officially completed on January 17, 2021. It contained numerous optimizations and bug fixes, including the re removal of the cookie god routine, which was useless due to another bug and often caused the program to get stuck and the addition of an anti-crash function, which would detect if the game got stuck in a menu and attempt to recover itself. Finally, Infinity Auto V4 came with the addition of milk strats, which make it more feasible for milkshakes to be collected during a league live event. To this date, this is the only auto to have utilized milk strats. At the time of its completion on January 19th, my auto was now collecting over 27 million cookies per hour. Although small optimizations had been made to this day, Infinity Auto V4 remains the newest iteration. There is a fifth version, which I worked on today, that uses a previously unknown exploit, but due to its um, low return value, I decided to not use it. So currently, I am using Infinity Auto V4. My collection history over the past month truly encapsulates the trend of Infinity Auto's growth. growth. In the last two seasons of 2020, I collected 2.25 billion and 2.69 billion cookies respectively. Both seasons were done with the Raspberry Pi Auto. On the season ending on January 11, 2021, I finished in second place on Storm behind the Mats Valk and fifth place worldwide when Infinity Auto was in its infancy. After that, I would never fail to lead again, collecting just shy of 4.3 billion on the season commencing on January 18th. 4.63 billion on the season of January 25th, 4.93 billion adjusted for the cookie cheat event on the season of February 2nd, and finally, as of the most recent season, I am on pace to complete the season 
with 17.3 billion league cookies with the help of a league event breaking the previous record of 11.6 billion held by MC. Well, we're like shattering the record. So anyway, it's time to show you the magic of Infinity Auto. As you can see right here, there's an orange cursor that is clicking the shadow cookie very quickly. And what it's doing is it's scanning a range in the center of the screen for a blue pixel. And you see when it taps it, there's another little, it kind of has an animation. So what happens is it actually is able to detect both. And then the live event function, you might have noticed it just got stuck here. Well, that's not the case. It's using milk strategies, milk strats. So when you go into a live event, a milkshake is like automatically spawning in the background. And if you collect a milkshake during a league live event, you get that boost. So it's extremely overpowered. So what the auto does is it sets a timer so it can wait to grab the milkshake right there. And the milkshake timer is variable. So it can be anywhere from 35 to 50 seconds after the previous milkshake. And just to be safe, I have it set to 48 seconds. So it will wait until, so in this case, it was a 20 second league event. So it was going to wait until 28 seconds had elapsed. So at the latest, it would collect it right as it spawned. So as you can see, it's still clicking and the league numbers are going up pretty quickly. The base rate's about 20 million per hour without any other effects. But with league events, it can range anywhere from about 24 billion an hour to 34 billion an hour. Another milkshake just spawned and it detected it automatically. Okay. So this time, the event did not get chosen. Why is that? Well, if there's less than 45 seconds on the clock, which is detected by the blue progress bar, it actually waits until the frenzy, because the frenzy has a pretty large boost as well. And if you can combine that with a milkshake and a 26x or 12x league event, you get a gigantic boost, like one or two million in that moment. So, you're going to see in 12 seconds which event is chosen. Okay, there it goes. And that is... Okay. Perfect. So what happened is a milkshake actually just spawned, so the program detected that, and instead of waiting for the next one, it just went ahead and tried to grab it, which it succeeded. And that was a 5x event. So that was a very lucky play on my part and that's something that no other auto can do. Infinity Auto is just exceptional in its ability to detect niche edge case circumstances and capitalize on it. The last thing you're going to see is the cookie sheet counter which is a basic fo function of any respectable auto. Uh, but you should see that it will choose it when it gets down to about zero. <laughs> Of course it'll be zero. So for now we'll just watch it for a little more. So that time it actually re-rolled an event because it determined it was not good enough and in, instead, it was able to get a 5x event. So, definitely a huge improvement. And the reason it automatically chose is because there should be a milkshake coming any second. And for some reason, it did not detect it. That's pretty rare, but it almost always detects it. You can see when it detects it when the cursor kind of flicks to the side really rapidly. Okay, so as you see on the bottom, the cookie sheet is going to be chosen almost instantly. There it goes. Alright. When there's a cookie sheet event, um, like a 5x or a 10x, um, that is huge and you can collect not only a high amount of league, but also a high amount of, say, cupcakes, light cookies, rainbow cookies. As you can see, I have 87 million cupcakes, which is insanely high. So I'm going to stop the auto and I'm going to show you 
this is the project directory, and I cannot show you the source code. Uh, but I can show you, whoops, this is the list of all the live events, and I have all the live events. It has to go through every single image. It's kind of a pain, but it works. All right, so that is the beauty of Infinity Auto V4. And that's how my seemingly hacking numbers are 100% legitimate. Thanks for watching, guys.